of her. It's her uncle's will. He's left her everything. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> From now on, you have a mistress, not a master. It is my intention to astonish you all. <laughs> Miss Everdeen's here now, so you better do your best for... Perhaps you could have lend a hand. You don't think I would? No, you wouldn't. <laughs> hey! 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 How much? Five pounds a quarter. Very well. <laughs> Miss Bathsheba Everdeen, would you like to marry me? Miss Aragard, I want a husband. If I ever were to marry, I'd want somebody to tame me, and you'd never be able to do it. Mr. Baldwood, Miss Everdeen, your neighbor. Good hunting, Miss Everdeen. He's rich. He's handsome. Miss Everdeen, I want very much to have you as my wife. I don't think I've ever seen a face as beautiful as yours. Meet me tomorrow. Nobody would know. You should have nothing to do with him. Don't listen to him. Don't believe him. Why? It is difficult for a woman to define her feelings in a language chiefly made by men to express theirs. I'm not such a fool as to imagine I might stand a chance. One day I will leave you. You can be sure of that. Miss Everdeen will never marry you.